Here we have Chelsea Swim. So when you first start it, you see that the legs are kicking down and the arms are reaching straight ahead of the head. So from the hips up towards the head, you're fairly horizontal, but the legs are really kicking down into the drag zone. So this is just making it much harder to get forward in the water. Once we stack everything nice and straight, then the legs will be drafting. So they're not going to be drag anymore, they're going to propel you, and then they're going to stay out of the way. So we're getting the hips rotate, nicely done. So when we're working on this, we're thinking single kick and pull on one side, getting that hip to move, and then again on the other side, good job. So over the water when you first started, you see a high head on breathing. And sometimes some difficulty getting over the water on the opposite side that you breathe on. So that just indicates rolling when we breathe and then not rolling through to the other side. So now what we're using is our hips to swim with, so the hips are going to move from side to side. That's going to give you the room to get the arm over the water and room to breathe when you're about to breathe. So when we are breathing, we're focusing on lifting the chin and dropping the top of the head down so the head stays horizontal. Nicely done. Keep up the good work.